balcony. I'm on the main square of Arroz. Look at that. It's a huge church right across. And Tada! The castle of Larissa. I'm going there tomorrow. I'm gonna get ready now because I want to visit the, the ancient uh, theater of uh, Argos. This is one part of the archaeological site of uh, Argos. I'm gonna get into the theater, which seems quite loud. And it's open. Okay, I got in. Um, the ticket is just three euro. Really, it's very cheap for that kind of uh, ecological site. So this is uh, the theater, and uh, the castle is over there. Because it's I still don't know what that is, but it's big. Look at that, and it has these holes on the on the wall. It's like. Uh, they were putting out the guns, and but I don't think they had guns <laughs> in ancient times. So, hmm. wow, look at all those rooms, all those walls. It's very big. Oh, thank God, the plate and some shade. <laughs> it's boiling hot. Let's see. What this is about? Ah, it's Sarapion, Asclepion, Thermes. Wow. Oh my god, look at that. This is huge. Look how big that theater is. Looks to me like that. That's the furthest up I can go. You see, there are ropes all around that uh, cover the area. But I have a very nice view from here. Right across from uh, the ancient theater is the ancient Agora. It has uh, Greek letters on. Let's go a bit closer. Um, the Ion Ke Ionimpheon, aha, Nimpheon, Nimpheon, Meta Eondoche. Interesting, again. So let's go and see what, what did I just read. Ah, the Tholos and the Nimpheon of the market. Castle um, of Larissa in Argos, uh, and then I saw this uh, sign about uh, the monastery of Panagia Katechimeni. That means monastery, okay, of Holy Mary of the Thunderstruck, which is a strange name for a monastery. So I was I want to check it out, but I don't know if it is um, open. There are a couple of cars here. There's a hill up there, Argos. The church looks quite old. But let's see if there is anyone here to let me in. Here, 
Okay, it says it's closed between 12. Now it's 9. Well, I'll ring and see what happens. <gasps> it's open. So strange architecture. Yeah. So, Larissa Castle of Argos. Okay. The castle was named, yeah, yeah, when it was, uh, uh, it was already fortification since the prehistoric remains of the Mycenaean fortification, 13th century before Christ. The present form of the castle was established in the Middle Ages. Okay. That's good information. Um, I'll, I'll take the main entrance. I don't know if they have uh, renovated, probably they have. It looks in amazing condition. Uh, let's see the view here. back 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 over there you see the a long road long straight road this is where I'm gonna drive you go all straight and then you turn right and you get to Tirinza and from Tirinza you can um, Naflu is a few kilometers far so today is castle the ecological the Mycenaean ecological site of Tirinza then I'll go to the other a castle of Napoli in Palamidi and if I have uh, some time I may go for a swim as well but I don't know, we'll have to see about that so let's explore the castle Tourists, yay! <sighs> Says exterior south courtyard. When the south uh, outer closure was cut off by the cross wall in the 15th century, the south side of the citadel and the main gate were exposed in attacks. In order to defend the gates, they constructed an additional wall, connecting the main lower of the citadel to the circular tower of the cross wall. So, I suppose this is it. That's the second uh, entrance that I was briefly thinking of following, but I, the, I prefer you, you start from the main one. Okay, let's go up there. And uh, 1,000 years from now, because the Greeks, the Greek archaeology society has renovated the, this castle. Um, 1,000 years later, the archaeologists of the time will say, oh, they 
the Greeks did this thing in 2020 something and we see here the traces about I think archaeology is is a science that will uh, always be oh can you see the little lizard tiny tiny lizard baby lizard hello good morning Kalimera Kalimera no it's gone um I'm not sure what that is Those big boulders do remind me of uh, Mycenaean uh, walls. Let's see the view from here. As I was saying, this is the Frankish building. And just next door here. We have a Mycenaean wall. Uh -huh. And here we have this, maybe was like a moat. Yeah, yeah maybe it was a moat. But, hmm. There would probably, there, probably there was some stairs here. And they would go in and uh, they were guarding uh, the first line. Okay. <laughs> There's a lot of birds here. And what's that here? Let's see. And this is the Byzantine gate. Can see it. <laughs> Kalimera birdie. 